It's day 23, and um, I didn't go to the gym again today. Um, unfortunately, I'm still not feeling very well. I can't jump around and move around, but my legs are feeling a lot better, so hopefully tomorrow I will be able to go for a walk or do something, get out. Um, I think that tomorrow is supposed to be legs day. Um, probably don't feel comfortable doing a leg day yet, but I'll do some walking um, and maybe some jogging maybe if I feel okay um, but I can do some upper body workouts I really wanted to do um, a shoulder workout because there was one movement that I saw that um, Erin Stern did on one of her videos on YouTube and it looks like it's really fun and I think that I can do it and um, so I'm trying to keep up my eating since I'm not moving around that much um, I'm trying to eat a lot less uh, my my lowest amount of calories to still um, keep up my metabolism and not you know let my body start starving so um, and then today I, I'm feeling a little bit better so I'm going to be cleaning a lot and hopefully get my house back in shape and it's a little bit messy today, or it has been since a while. Um, I'm a crafty person, and sometimes I will bring a craft out, and I might not put it away right away. So, for example, on Mother's Day, I made um, a bunch of the mothers around me some, like, a little candle holder thing, and I put um, tissue paper, and I use... Um, I think it's called Mod Podge and I used it and I put the tissue paper around the glass um, of the candle holder and then I put more Mod Podge on top of it and then I put like a little flameless tea light inside with little um, colorful rocks and um, I forget what they're called. They're not like rocks, they're kind of decorative. And it was really cute, and it was a big hit, um, but unfortunately, the stuff is still here, and I haven't moved it. And I think my boyfriend is getting a little bit upset, because I'm not so tidy. So hopefully I can figure out a schedule where I'm a lot more tidy, and I can manage everything. Um, so, something that I wanted to say, um, I was thinking about this earlier, on Monday, today is Wednesday, on Monday um, when my boyfriend and I went to the gym after I got back from my sister's house, uh, we had to leave early, which I had said in the previous video, because a special friend visited, um, but he never like made me feel uncomfortable or bad that it happened and that I... I always said that I had to leave and that I would leave the workout schedule with him so that he could continue working, but he never um, he never left me. He didn't, he didn't want to, like, I don't know. It was really sweet. He didn't want to leave me. He didn't, didn't make me feel uncomfortable, and it was no big deal. And Plus, we finished the workout at home, so that was also good. And I just feel kind of privileged to have... Um, such a nice man that will be nice to me like that <laughs> and understand. Um, sometimes I know it's hard for a man to understand what women go through during that time. Our emotions are crazy and, you know, whatever. Um, I'm having a slight issue with cravings. Um, I got macaroni and cheese. We went grocery shopping yesterday, which I had to have Ryan go with me so that it didn't take a long time because I wasn't feeling very well and I didn't have any energy. And I got some chocolate and I got um, macaroni and cheese, not to mix together, but just to eat separately. And the chocolate's gone. So hopefully. I'm not going to be derailed for too long. Um, I really want to get back into the gym and get started again. I miss it. It's a lot of fun. I like, you know, starting early in the morning and getting it all done and then having the rest of the day 
to do whatever I want and I like to keep my my food on ta on schedule and keep eating healthy and feeling good um because I know like when I leave the gym I have a lot of energy and I feel happy and energetic and just excited and I like going to the gym I never thought I would um and I know that some people don't like going to the gym, but maybe they just don't know what to do at the gym. So you just find a program, I guess, that suits you. Some people work a lot better at home, and that's great. As long as you keep moving and get your heart rate up and sweat and keep your food clean, and I think everything would be fine. Um, yesterday we... At the grocery store, we rented Redbox, and we got um, Beautiful Creatures, and then some other movie. I can't remember what it's called, um, but they were okay. And then I got a free coupon little code thing for a free movie, so I'm going to go walk up to the grocery store um, that's in the city, and I'm going to get a free one. I got a whole list on my phone of movies to watch, but I'm not going to get two this time. I'm only going to get one just because I know that looking around, I have a lot of cleaning to do and I can't really sit around. I don't want to sit around. Oh, and I have to prep food. So we got, um, we get a lot of chicken and we get a lot of ground turkey because that's the main source. Oh, and eggs. And those are the main sources of our protein. Um, we try not to take protein powder very much, and sometimes I won't have it at all in a day. Um, so I'm going to try to prep. I'm going to cook up some of the chicken and make it in the crock pot and make shredded chicken. Um, it really smells up the house. It, it smells nice. And then I'm going to cook up the ground turkey, and I'm going to make a chili that is from, the recipe is from Jamie Eason's um recipe page on bodybuilding.com and I kind of switched it around just because she had some stuff that didn't really fit us like the brown sugar we didn't want to eat the brown sugar because there's too much sugar in it anyway um, because of the tomato sauce just because it has sugar so I thought about trying to make my own tomato sauce so that's a lot of work so I'm gonna make the chili and um, I'll put a link in the description bar down below with her recipe. Um, and let's see what else. Oh, I was going to make her cinnamon swirl bread, I think. Um, it makes, in an 8x8 pan, it makes 16 squares, and each square is 55 calories and 5 grams of protein. So I'm going to make that and see how it turns out because a lot of people in the fitness group on the Facebook page say that it's really yummy and they have trouble to um, just not eat it like or to not eat it. They, they want to eat it all. So we'll see. Hopefully that works. And also maybe I might make, um, what are they called, like a egg muffin. So... Um, there's another girl that I follow. Her name is Little B, and it's her website is Little B's Healthy Habits. I think I'll put that link down below too. Um, she makes these egg egg white muffins. She puts egg whites in it, and she puts vegetables blended up, and then she puts them in a muffin tin and bakes them, and then just puts like some hot sauce on it or something, and they actually taste pretty good. So I'm going to make those again. Um, and I think that that's about it. So just basically my goal today is to keep eating healthy, maybe move a bit more since I didn't really move that much yesterday, and to not overeat, not undereat, get all my food prepped, and get the house cleaned up a little bit. <laughs> Hopefully a lot of it, but, you know, I'll get whatever I can done. So tomorrow we will see if I can go back to the gym and do at least a walk. I think waking up so early is a little bit hard for me just because I haven't been waking up that early. Um, but we'll see tomorrow and I'll try and I'll try and just get my walk done and then maybe some upper body and 
that's it. So we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.